you guys are not gonna believe some of these AI updates that have just happened. It's mind blowing. Let's go ahead and jump into these AI updates. Please like and subscribe to our channel. Let's dive into the number one AI update for you. Amazon has invested or will invest up to $4 billion in the AI startup Anthropic. So Amazon just announced on Monday, it's going to invest up to $4 billion in the AI startup Anthropic. They are the main makers behind Claude AI, which I have done a few videos about Claude AI, so I highly recommend checking those out. Uh, but it's been wild in the AI world. Microsoft has thrown in $13 billion into the AI ring. Google tossed in almost $30.7 uh, billion, and now Amazon is getting into the mix, making a big bet on Anthropic. Meta has also thrown in a whopping $33 billion into their AI research and development and investments. Now, Google originally invested $300 million into Anthropic. It was perceived as a partnership that was going to mirror Microsoft, uh, Microsoft and OpenAI's collaboration, but the deal with Amazon makes Amazon Web Services, AWS, the primary cloud partner for Anthropic now. I'm really excited on what's happening with the Amazon investment into Anthropic. I highly recommend checking out Claude because I'm a huge fan of it for different variations of that compared to ChatGPT with OpenAI. I actually did a ChatGPT versus Claude video, so highly recommend checking that out on my channel. Update number two in the AI race is that Spotify is now going to use AI to replicate the podcaster's voice and translate them into other languages. Uh, Lex Friedman on the Lex Friedman uh, Twitter and his podcast actually announced this announcement. So they announced on Monday that there will be a new AI feature that will translate uh, podcasts into different languages automatically and it's going to use the host's own voice to feed into that and then do the translations. It's massively going to change the way that podcasting is done and as a content creator myself I'm really excited to see what's going to happen with that. The technology is going to be able to create realistic synthetic voices just from a few seconds of speech. OpenAI really release that in a statement, which is going to be, yeah, pretty interesting. It's also very scary. Uh, some of the implications where scammers, other people will be able to use the same technology and masquerade as you trying to steal other people's information. The feature is going to be starting to roll out here in a few coming weeks and months. Definitely stay tuned to watch out for some more of those updates. And number three, huge update from OpenAI is that ChatGPT can now see, talk, and listen. So the current interface for ChatGPT is you have to type everything in or copy paste in everything. But now the new version allows users to speak out loud or they can upload an image to prompt the AI chatbot. The new feature is going to be available to the paid subscribers for the ChatGPT Plus plan in two weeks. And also uh, ChatGPT is going to be releasing here pretty soon that every ChatGPT account is going to have access to real internet live data where the cutoff for the free plan was data up until September 2021. So OpenAI is uh, definitely continuing to develop and do some amazing updates. Those are the three main AI updates that you need to know about. Please remember to like and subscribe to my channel for more AI updates. And please check out some of my other videos where I talk about AI tools in sales, marketing, in programming, and a lot of other arenas. And I thank you so much for tuning in. Remember to keep moving forward and I will catch you next time. Bye-bye.